I'm one of the six divers on the boat, I'm trying to catch sea otters. And what do you have to wear to catch sea otters, George? Well, we all wear dry suits here in Alaska because the water is very cold. How does a dry suit work? Well, a dry suit is different than a wetsuit in that it, it keeps you dry with these seals that go around your wrist. They seal out the water. And then you have also a seal around your neck to keep the water from coming into the suit so your body doesn't have to continually reheat water like on a wetsuit. And what about at your feet? What happens at your feet? The feet is just a continuous sock that's covered by a boot for protection and traction. Mm -hmm. And does that dry suit keep you warm enough all by itself or do you have other layers of insulation? Well, air is, air is a main insulator. I have a bottle that I put in this pocket that inflates through this valve. Putting air in my suit is, is added insulation. So you have insulation just like sea otters then? Pretty much. I'm trying to emulate the sea otter. Make sure your neck seal isn't folded over, otherwise it'll leak. And then we have a waterproof zipper, which Ben will give me a hand with, right, Ben? Sure. It's hard to get this one started. And these are expensive zippers, so we don't want to mess them up. zippers closed all the way and there's a zipper protector that goes on over the top of that to keep your gear from rubbing on the zipper can you feel it if you're taking on water or do you just oh, always yeah, feel you cold feel yeah if you have the smallest leak you'll feel it in this water this water is about 45 46 degrees